Hi, how are you? This is Robin again from City Sewing in New York, www.citysewing.com. Here I have a brother machine. I want to show you this machine. Um, I'm going to turn it on. I'm going to show you right now. Machine is on. Everything's good. Here I could select any stitches that I want right over here. Here I could show you this. You know, you select what stitches you want. But what happened is when I go and press on, on sewing, I got an E1. Look at that, E1, R1. This is very common um, within the brother's machine. I think they make a mistake with that, adding that safety feature to the machine because what happens is this happens all the time and we get a lot of machines with the same problem. Every time, you know, E1, E1. Well, everybody goes and search on the internet and it's definitely telling you that E1 is the foot lifting up. When you put the foot lifter up, you forget to put it down. That's why you're getting an error. But sometimes it doesn't work like that. You know, you could you could try up and down, up and down, up and down all the time and it doesn't work. So that's not the problem. I'm gonna show you what's the real reason why this needs to be fixed. And I'm gonna show you how to do it. In here, I have, when I press the foot lifter up and down, see now, if you look at the arrow here, now it disappeared because the foot is down. But what the problem is, it's inside here. It's not a hard fix. It's just uncomfortable because you have to open up this machine. It has a lot of screws. And if you don't do it right, you're gonna break the machine. But the problem that this machine show you when you lift the foot up like that, is you get the E one right away, the other one, but why? Well, this is what happens right here. I wanna show you this spot right here, this black part that you see here. What happened is when you lift the foot up, you see that this part is moving right here. See, when you push it up, the part, it's in the back. See that, how it goes back and forth? Back and forth. So what happens is when you lift the foot up, there's a laser right here, it's a sensor that's telling the machine that the machine is on the safe position. So you can't run it. It will tell you, no, you have to bring the foot down. So this part is gonna go back. Now the sensor is telling the machine, okay, I'm back into the sewing mode. But what happens is that this part that you see here, this silver plate, that you see here moving goes all the way from top, from top to bottom. So when you push it up, it pushes to the side. But what happens is that this part here, it gets stuck on the bottom here. It does, it's not set up with a screw. It's just a little clamp. So when you do this, this part is not moving. The part stays in the left, like that. You lift the foot up and the part is not moving. It stays on the left. So it doesn't matter how much you go up and down, this part is not moving, it stays on the left. It can't do that, it needs to go up and down. Up and down, and it needs to move left to right. That activated and disactivated. And this part gets dry and it always gets stuck into the machine and it's not moving. That's that's the reason why. So this is a pretty easy, simple fix. Just loose up everything, take the covers out, go inside and make sure that, that when you can see that this part here, it's actually activating. Once you just take a WD-40, like an ID, spray a little bit and just kind of a squiggly with a drill screwdriver, get it loose, because it has to move like that. It needs to move back and forth. Every time you lift it up, it goes. Every time you bring it down, it goes back. You see? If it stays in one position always, then you're gonna have a problem. That's it, that's easy. Very, that's the only way you fix the E1, okay? Okay, the machine is working fine. See here, I lift the foot up. I press on the presser foot E1, you see? But when I bring it down, the machine goes back into sewing mode. So remember, the problem with that is that lever on the back that needs to go back and forth. When you, when the machine is disactivated, it's like that. When you lift the foot, it goes up, it's blocking the sensor here. So the machine understand that it's on safe mode, it can move. So make sure that you look in that, moving, and you'll be fine. Again, this is Robin from City Sewing in New York, www.citysewing.com with another sewing repair tip. Let's go.